Um, we've also then got Garmin. So they're win one of five Garmin Drive Smart sat navs. And then if you go down to the bottom, Ellie, you may just need to do that quickly. So I'm pretty sure this one is uh, like you've got to answer a question. So rather than voting or something like that, they're asking you. No. So like we said before, you can basically ask any question you want and it can be a multiple choice answer or it can be typed and, and, and written as you need to. Oh, I've already entered it, so. <laughs> so we've already entered this competition, so that's why it's not letting us do it, because we're entering it as, we're logged in as Carla um, from Social Network Solutions. So we had to, what are the features of it? And we had to then, obviously the features are, are here anyway, so it's a pretty self-explanatory answer for this competition, but it's making people just, you, this is how you kind of whittle out people that are competition hunters, if you like. What, you, what we've learned is that competition hunters like when it's just click this link to enter and they click the link, register the details, and then they're off to find the next one. So if you make it a bit harder, a bit more, you know, there's more work to do to enter. If you've got to upload a picture, vote for something, you've got to actually type in an answer, then you'll get less of them people come in and try and, try and enter the competitions. Um, so you can see here that we've got the standard entry method. We've then got share for bonus entries. So literally just by clicking this, you can share to Facebook, to Twitter, by email, and then you'll get a bonus entry for sharing that on your social platform. So then if you can encourage people to do that, then like we said, the knock-on effect of all of their friends seeing it and stuff like that. Good job, we've got no friends on this account, haven't I? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, that's basically how the competitions work. 